Hey, have you noticed how some words are often mispronounced? It's like a pet peeve of mine. Oh, definitely. Let's have a little pronunciation showdown. I'll start. How do you say library? Library, of course. Not library. It drives me crazy when people say it wrong. Totally agree. Now what about comfortable? That's a good one. It's comfortable, not comfortable. Exactly. How about this one? Wednesday. Oh, that's a classic. It's Wednesday, not Wednesday. Come on, people. Remember last week when you said sherbet wrong? Ah, uh, yes. It's sherbet, not sherbet. Why does everyone add that extra R? Maybe because it's sweeter. Now, don't get me started on pronunciation itself. Haha, <laughs> right. It's pronunciation, not pronunciation. The irony. Okay, now here's one that gets on my nerves. Espresso. It's S. Express O, not expresso. I know, right? And it's not especially. It's especially. But wait, is it nuclear or nuclear? It's nuclear, like nuclear. Gotcha. But do you know what's funny? People who say supposedly instead of supposedly. Oh, that's a good one. And for all intents and purposes, not for all intensive purposes. All right, last one. How do you say mischievous? It's mischievous, not mischievous. So many syllables added for no reason. Correcting our pronunciation might seem like a small thing, but it can really boost our confidence and clarity. It's not just about sounding right. It's about being understood correctly. So, let's keep practicing and correcting each other. Because confident communication is key. Subscribe to Confidence Pay for more tips on improving your English and communication skills. Connect with confidence.